Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have another collective haul. Um, I've been buying things here and there and I also went to the expo um, this past Saturday with my friend Andrea and we did a little bit of damage, not so much, but there was some damage. I have this basket full of things that I wanna show you and let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so from the expo, um, I bought this um, paper kit and it's from Photoplay. It's the Trick or Treat by Michelle Coleman. And Andrea went on Friday and she picked this one up. So obviously I had to grab it myself. And that is what it looks like so so cool i really love the colors it kind of reminds me a little bit of um hey pumpkin so i really like this um collection or that paper kit we also stopped by at the um teresa collins um boot and they had um buy one get one free and some of her items and i'm always doing shakers so i always need acetate um and i believe these were ten dollars for or less probably honestly i don't remember but there were 12 there are 12 of them and we split um so andrea kept um the other one and i brought this one home okay, so from the Teresa collins booth i also grabbed this paper collection um it is create a before life I, oh after midnight it's after midnight and that is what it looks like it has two sheets of each so i really like that it's really clean um i grabbed this uh, mitten die that's what it's supposed to look like and i believe these i don't remember they're four dollars or five dollars but um and then we went to another boot and they had their dies for $11. And this is, I believe this one's from last year. And that's the number right there. This is a 2022 um, Christmas collection. And then I grabbed two sets of stamps and stencil, uh, stencils. Um, I really grabbed this one because of the moon and I thought that maybe I could use this for um, Christmas. That's cute. Okay, and then I also grabbed this um, um, Halloween stamps and uh, stamps and stencil set because I thought it was so cute. Look at that cute little ghosty. It's so so cute. Um, and they also had this one in the um, rubber stamps, and I believe that one was thirty dollars. So there goes the information right there and this one was from it doesn't say it does not say hmm okay so i grabbed that um andrea is to blame for for all of this by the way because she showed me everything that she had bought and so obviously i had to go um, buy them myself um these were i believe these were a dollar or two dollars so i bought those they also had a lot of brads and i bought these bats right here i bought the santa claus and mrs santa claus i grabbed the witch legs the coffee mugs christmas um coffee not mugs but coffee christmas coffee oh my gosh gabby get it together i also grabbed some gingerbreads and i do not like gingerbreads but i thought these were so cute and it was a little girl a boy and oh this is from this one in case you guys want to go and i paid 32.90 for a bunch of other stuff Okay, um, I grabbed some pumpkin sequins. These were a dollar. 
I think these were a little pricey. I think these were like $3. And then I grabbed these neon enamel dots. And also from the expo, I bought some Copic markers. Um, let's see, backwards. Ah, just kidding. There we are. Okay. Um, what else did I get? Okay, everything else, I believe it's from everywhere else. Let's see, from Spellbinders. I grab this Christmas sweater. It's a stitch Christmas sweater and I kept like wanting to buy it, but it was so expensive. I believe it was like $32 and I finally grabbed it for $24. It's still a little pricey, but in my defense, it's four dice. And look at the size of the sweater too. It's pretty big. Um, and I'm really into stitching right now. So, uh, from Walmart, I grabbed um, the tool ribbon. And this is more like a hot pink. I grabbed these bats. Um, I, grabbed, I grabbed a couple. Look how tiny these are. They're silky too. So I grabbed those and pastel. Um, also from Walmart, I grabbed this trim. And it's like a hot pink. I don't know why my camera is showing that color. Uh, but um, this is really cute, you guys. So from Hobby Lobby, I grabbed the acrylic tags that I was not able to find last year. And I'm really into those acrylic things. I bought two packs of the round ones. I grabbed some of the glow in the dark alphabet, alpha beats, alphabets, well alphabet beats. So we was going to a, um, Here's the other one. Julie was going to a Taylor Swift um, movie and she wanted me to make her some, some bracelets. So that's the second pack. And then I grab another pack of these keychains. These glow in the dark. Hobby Lobby. Um, and then I bought some red ribbon. And so, and let's see. I grabbed some of these Christmas, um, they're for resin, but they're like little sequins. And they were already, I think 40%. Honestly, I don't know, I don't remember. I grabbed some of this other trim. This is actually gonna be for my um, Christmas wrapping this year. Um, and then lastly, I think lastly from Hobby Lobby, um, I grabbed this trim that everybody was hauling last year. I was able to find the last one at my store this year. Um, and this is what I plan to do with it. Look at that. Isn't that cool? So, trying to do something different to my trims. And that's also going to be for this other trim that I grabbed at um, Home Goods. And then I'm just going to add some um, C beads right here, right in the middle. So, and this was $3.99, which I thought was pricey, but it was cute. It was the last one there, too. Okay, um, what else? What else is left? I think the only other thing left is this. Um, I know we had said that we were gonna, not gonna buy from Michaels anymore, but look at this paper pad. It's Candy Brights and it was already 40% off and I had to buy it, you guys. 
I just had to buy it. Let me show you guys really quick. It has pink foil. Some of them are not cute, but for me, I always use those for the inside of our projects. Look at this one. Not cool. Just had to get it. so cute and that one also has like gold foil cutouts candy it's so cute this is a foil I don't know if this is from last year but it's new to me that one reminds me of um, Doodle Bug, the acetate sheet. That's really cute right there. The blue one. Yep. There you go. It's really cute. I think that is it. Um, and um, yeah, that's it for my haul. I hope you guys are having a great day and thank you so much for watching and until the next time, I'll talk to you soon. Bye.